Hey everybody, it's me, Super Paul Games, and welcome back to Ghost Control Incorporated. You can see right there, Steve. He's kind of stressed out and nervous in the office. Why? Because in five days our rent will be due, and we're going to be big time in debt if we don't find some work between now and when rent is due. It's like, somebody call, somebody call on the phone. Um, I would love to hire somebody new, but we most assuredly cannot afford that at this moment. I'd also like to expand into here or to the bathroom area. We apparently have two bathrooms, but... And Don is just sitting there, I guess, trusting that Steve knows what he's doing. Oh, come on, somebody's got a call. <laughs> it is four in the a.m., but ghosts don't rest, do they? I would think they'd be most active at night. Uh, I need your help. Are you the ghost hunters? I'm in the office. I've seen just a few ghosts in our fax machine. Oh, we need this work really badly. I mean, uh, sounds like you need professional help. We'll be on our way. Donna, we got a roll. We can get some money. We can maybe pay rent. Oh, shit. I don't know if this new headquarters was a good idea. All the other teams are way closer. I don't even know if we can afford gas money. Come on, you little shitmobile. Oh, man. A competitor just stole your job. Crap. Yeah, I guess we might as well go to the gas station. Damn it, competitors. We need to make a living, too. I just want to bust ghosts. Since we're here in London, can we bust some, like, kings and queens? Some royalty of yesteryear? Let's see, a hundred and... We cannot afford a full tank of gas. How about 75% of a tank? Or fill it up to 75%. We have 36 pounds left. That's not so good. I guess we'll go back to the headquarters and wait. Eventually, we're going to buy a new car. That's unfortunately not unlocked yet. He was like, don't worry, Donna, we'll get a job. Oh my god, oh my god, are we gonna get a job? I'm screwed, did we overextend ourselves? I can't let Donna know. No, we'll get a job. We'll have something come through. Just have to have faith. Where's Donna, the manly woman? Just kind of staring at the wall like, durr. Which is surprising, because their intelligence is actually more than Steve's. What's her biggest weakness? Constitution. She's a weak constitution. Um, I believe we already read the newspaper. Yep, about the T-Rex last time. Ooh, we can sell some ectoplasm in the vault. We're going to sell that. If need be, we'll be able to fill up our gas tank. Oh, yes! I need a job. Hi, I hope you can help. Our guests are molested by two ghosts. Oh, will they molest me? It's been a while since anyone has. Give us five minutes and we'll be there. Donna, quickly. Oh, man. Maybe we shouldn't have switched headquarters. That would have been right by our old one. Luckily, the quick attack team is busy getting gas. Do not turn. Whew. Maybe they didn't get called about that one. Never fear. Uh, Ghost Control Incorporated is here. It seems a paranormal reality. Really? All right, we're here in the restaurant. Let's try and do this right this time, which I didn't do last time. Don, I get a reading. There are three ghosts read. Um, I think she got a constitution for that. And then we're going to have her switch her trap with her um, EMF detector. And we're just going to have Steve just take a look into the main dining area. I don't know why. Ooh. What's that? It's a ghoul. Its special ability is weakening strike. I wonder if that's in our ghoulopedia. Spookopedia. Imagine a mixture of the Hulk, Frankenstein's monster, and your mother-in-law. Oh my god, that's scary. And you've got an idea of the ghoul. This brute is ready to knock heads off of shoulders. If you let it get too close to you, take care. Keep this one at a safe distance. All right, we want to keep it um, far away. And the nice thing is I don't have a mother-in-law, so no one's going to get offended that I was like, oh... Dripping. It's going to drip on you. Ew. All right. Nice shot, Steve. No, no. Get away. Did it just jizz pee on the floor? Um, 
Fuck. It has nine energy left. We better move backwards. All right, we're going to fire. Oh, does she still have her shitty weapon? Oh, she does. She has the you suck vacuum cleaner. We will have her drop a trap. And then, you know what, Donna? You might have to take one for the team. Oh, no. He has six energy left. I'm pretty sure the trap is not powerful enough to trap a level six ghost. Oh, he hit Steve, weakening him. Blast him, Steve. Teach that ghost what's for the zombie. Here you have it. The power of love. What? He's like, I'm going to love you, Huey Lewis in the new style. Oh, come on, trap. Don't fail me now. Excellent. Donna, retrieve that trap. Ew, there's ghost pee everywhere. Or zombie pee. That's nasty. Um, Donna, why don't you go walk over it? <laughs> that means there should be two ghosts left here. Ooh, what the fuck? No, you're supposed to walk over it. Oh, it makes you slide? Well, that'll work for Steve, because he's going forward. Woo! I guess, Donna, we're going to have to have you set up here. And then walk into it as you bump into Steve's buttocks. Ooh, two Halloween spirits. One is nine. Uh, let's look at our Spookopedia for them. I don't believe, believe I've read that off before. Halloween spirit, who's dressed in sheets, running around chasing kids? The Halloween spook is a classic ghost. White. Are you saying white people are scary? What's going on here? Mostly scary and dull. Suck it up. Suck it up as soon as you can. Suck it up all night long. Um, can we blast the far one? Nope. Steve just shot some damage into the um, restaurant wall. Restaurant, restaurant wall. <laughs> Uh-oh. All right, that ghost is pretty weak. St uh, Donna, can you hit him? God dang it, woman! Are you worth anything? Oh, you did hit him for one. All right, we'll have Steve drop his trap right there. And blast this bastard. I'll show you the Britain's Got Talent. See, the cool thing about that, because that trap has a wide range... It could pick up a ghost that wasn't directly over it. And that's what happened. That's the powerful one. Ugh. He's got nine power. Donna, can you hit this? No, it was Steve. Pull him in. Oops. Down to seven. Down to five. Donna, if you hit twice, we can capture this guy. Maybe not, because she's got a super weak weapon. <laughs> you didn't think that could happen. <laughs> Think what? That you'd fail? Oh no. They scared Steve. <laughs> Come on, Steve. Blast that bastard. No, not the chair! He's like, fuck that chair. It wasn't ever comfortable. And that table. Who wouldn't give me reservations here? Oh, he's out of control. Donna is slowly weakening him. There we go. Woo. Can we leave already? Steve, negative seven sanity. That could have been dangerous if that would have kept up. Um... Plus one constitution and aim for Donna. Plus one intelligence and one morale for Steve. Um, and we better go to the hospital. You gotta get Steve's sanity back up. We need to get 339 more dollars, though, or there's no fucking way we're making rent. <laughs> that is more than a little worrisome. Because then we're gonna be homeless. I think that's the end of the game. Yeah, I, I'll heal them. Don't worry. Go, we're going right to the hospital game. It's going to be 120 to heal them all. Well, here's heal Steve. Then we'll go pick up some gas while we're at it. Uh, we can get a full tank. Not bad. We're still in a place now. We're going to be negative. It's 602. It's kind of hard to read that. You know, actually, fuck it. We're going to... We still got five more days. We're going to go get her a new weapon. Like, our homemade vacuum cleaner does such little damage. It's just not worth it. All 
All right, Donna, let us sell the You Suck vacuum cleaner. We can get the Suck It Ghost back. That has more pull, but not more damage. I kind of like the Sucker Punch that um, Steve has. Because it does two damage and it pulls. What about the beam? Four damage. No, I... Yeah, none of these are really better. That's three damage and three range, but I'd rather have the bigger range. Right, we'll get her a Sucker Punch back, too. So we're almost a grand. We'll be a grand in debt in five days. Ooh, incoming call. I need help. Somebody recommended calling you. My Oyster card needs a recharge. Um, we will be there, apparently at the tube station. Aha, and our competitors have no chance. What the hell? Did I hit something to stop? Go. Go, you fucking bastards. Why did you stop? Move the vehicle! What the hell? No! There we go. I don't know what happened control-wise. Maybe we were just fucking with that other group? Yeah, we're not gonna it get it. Spooky in it. Ah, uh, there's a specter here. Energy level five. You have a shot on that, Steve? You do, but let's go up here where we've got a better shot. Get over here. People need to use the underground. Come on, Donna, let's form a wall. Oh yeah, I like having that new weapon already. That specter's already down to one. Oh, what the fuck was that? It's some bastard attack on Steve. Alright, Steve, why don't you go just drop your trap under him? Oh, I, Donna will... Never mind. We'll catch them with this trap. <laughs> Donna, how are you the more intelligent one? We'll catch them with this trap. Why do you think we got the trap? I will beam you back to where you came from. One down? Oh, I didn't... I should have had Donna get out her uh, meter to see. Oh, there we go. How many there were. All right, that ghost has... What's he got? Four? I'll just drop a trap right under him and then have Steve blast him. Uh, Steve got some aim, but he didn't finish the ghost off. Come on, the ghost is down to energy. Pick it up, trap. Uh-oh. It did get him, after all. Excellent. All right, Donna, while you're at it, I should have done this first of all. Let's get a sensor reading. All right, so there's only one ghost left, and he's in the... I think that's the restroom over there. Not quite sure how we access it. Oh, wait, there's the door right there. Where did your trap go, Steve? Did it blow up? Oh, wait, no, it's there. He picked it up because it's full. I don't know why it's on his head. I guess he wears it on a, as a hat. I have a ghost hat, everybody. All right, Donna, put away your meter. And, um... Yeah, we'll, we'll automatically pick up that trap when we leave. Come on, charge, man! Little kids, or, I don't know, whoever the hell uses the subway system needs it. Oh, I love generic cola. That ghost has taken one hell of a shit. What's the specter? Energy level nine. Oh, that's problematic. I'll blow you some M and Thala holes. I don't even know what that means. He just said he wanted to blow him. Come on, Dana. 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 <laughs> well, he looks like a, she looks like a guy. You can forgive me for calling him Dan. Oh, and you curse Steve? Come on, we can't afford that shit. Alright, Steve, lay your trap down right under the stupid thing and then blast it. Oh, crap, that was your thing. Move and drop. Oh. Alright, despite the fact he's cursed, he's doing pretty well. Oh, my God. It's full of guns. Now it's time to go sleepy by. Suck it, ghosts. Uh, Steve gets another constitution and aim point, and uh, Donna gets another aim and morale point. 
Uh oh, pandemonium at sea! I assume that's an article about pandas who have mutinied and taken over a ship. Strange events have cut short the holidays on the Tasmanian cruise lines regularly at 3.33 a.m. The emergency speakers of the ship bellowed the exact same signal which everybody said, This is an emergency! Everyone overboard! The Spaniards have hit us with the cannons! Cannons. At the exact moment, all pandemonium broke loose at the lifeboats. Maybe the Spaniards really did attack them. After a week of these disturbances, one of the crew found a strange symbol etched into one of the walls of the ship. The symbol has been identified as the signet of Captain Crook, who had mysteriously vanished under strange circumstances in 1632. Was he on the Flying Dutchman? Oh, we almost have enough money to make sure that we can pay all our bills for the, uh, the next time bills come around. That is awesome, Sauce. We're gonna run back to the hospital for just a quick moment. And then we actually we're gonna run over to the headquarters first. Or we won't. We'll go to the headquarters we'll go to the hospital. Oh there we go. Apparently it's kind of delayed on when those things happen. The reason I wanted to come here was to empty our traps. We'll run right to the hospital. I swear this vehicle cannot drive uphill. Uh, apparently our competitors... Oh, they needed gas. I thought they would got fucked up too. Get rid of the curse and heal both of these dudes and dudettes. Get us some gas. And that's going to be the end of this episode. I hope you're enjoying this. Um, I really like this game. It's a hell of a lot of fun. We're pretty close to being able to pay our debt off. Or basically being able to pay rent. I'll see you all next time when we should get enough money for that. Thanks for hanging out.